Hello guys, in this tutorial we will learn about the Android Studio most powerful layout designer. It's called a coordinator. So the coordinator layout is described as it's a super powered frame layout according to the documents. It facilitates how views within your layout interact with interact with each other. So this is done by creating or assigning specific behaviors to these views. We will not go deep in uh, how coordinator works. We will de go deep in how the examples where to, to use a coordinator. These behaviors are the core to what makes material design unique and we will learn in next videos and also in next tutorials how the, uh, we can benefit from material design and uh, including a familiar interactions such as a sliding drawers, panels and to swipe at dismissible uh, elements and button, uh, buttons and more more uh, complex uh, layouts and complex UI. So till now let's go to Android Studio Let's click a new Android Studio project and select the scrolling activity. Next, and we will type scrolling, double G, I will make it, and waiting the, waiting for a, the a project. So, if we go to the main activity, scrolling activity would be as a, a complex uh, for a person would be beginner. But don't worry, these are very simple. Later on, uh, you will master all the Android concepts okay so let's dive uh, uh, let's see here that in order to set the content view we we put or to specify the layout for which uh, the uh, for the activity we put in the set content view R dot layout dot activity underscore scrolling. So if we click on control plus plus left click, it will open this view. So activity scrolling, it is using coordinator layout. So the coordinator layout, and we see in the text, it the main a main thing in our main layout using and holding all of these children. Don't worry if you are not understanding it is, uh, it's very, uh, very, they are easy concept, but for a the beginner, they are hard sometimes. So let's uh, see. So coordinator layout is the main layout holding all its children. Coordinator layout is this in the blue. App bar, this is the app bar. This is the include. This will include another layout. So if we click on the include, it will open another nested scroller view. Scroll view. Scroll view would be a scrolling view that contains a long text. If you scroll, like this, you will see the text. So, till now, the coordinator layout is used for complex Android uh, views. So let's hit run and see what coordinator layout will be will result. Fab, fab. This is the fab floating action bar. Uh, we, uh, this is just a floating button that would be a, a good, uh, it will give you a good uh, design used in material design and used in many apps. And include, 
this will include a layout inside the layout so don't worry we just focus on the uh, coordinated layout and see what is the example example of this layout Just waiting the Android Studio and Android emulator. So this is our app. This is the scrolling. You see, this is the coordinated layout holding all its parents, all its children. So the first child is the app bar. The second is the fab floating action bar. A button sorry and the third is a nested scroller view this is used for a, a long text so you see that the coordinate layout is a powerful powerful uh, layout used for complex ui thank you guys we will see later on uh, more about card views uh, recycler views and uh, using the uh, the coordinate layout so uh, uh check please the uh, advanced con uh, advanced uh, android concepts and advanced views for more info about coordinate layout thank you guys see you in next videos next video